Hey folks, this is the Nocturnal Nerd. Welcome to the sixth episode of my playthrough of Hollow Knight. Uh, thank you for joining me. Uh, if you haven't watched the other episodes, that's fine. Uh, you might want to go and watch them if you want to know what's going on. If not, it's up to you. Don't mind. Just happy to have you along. Um, so we're going to pick up right where we left off. We've just rescued Britta, who is the bug that's currently sitting next to me on the bench. Um, and we've done a few other bits and pieces as well. Um, and to be honest, I haven't played in about a week. So um, I'm just going to have a quick look around and try and figure out what I need to do, what I want to do next. Um, we could explore a bit more green path, although I don't think we can yet. Uh, tell you what, why don't we go down to the City of Tears and have a look around there? Because we did we did unlock um, a Deep Nest, but I don't quite have the right attitude to take on Deep Nest at the moment. If you're familiar, you'll know that it's not necessarily the nicest place to be. Uh, I also can't remember, sorry, wrong button. I can't remember if I've got the... Yes, I do, the Fire Lantern. So, I am sort of ready for it, but I'm not... I don't think I'm going to take it on today. Um... Yeah, so we'll try something else instead. Tell you what we can do, we can uh, we can head up to around here and move on upwards to about here and if memory serves there's like quite a bit to do around this area and that will unlock even more for us later on so I feel like that's a sort of natural progression. As usual, for anyone that cares about this sort of thing, I'm playing on PC through Xbox Game Pass. Um, and I am playing using a controller. Um, just because I think it feels more, this game feels more natural with a controller. Oh, wrong button. Um, not off to a good start, but we'll get there. Um, it is a PlayStation controller, not an Xbox controller. But that's just because I don't have an Xbox controller at the moment. Um, but yeah, the mapping works and I'm used to playing it on PlayStation, so it feels nice. Um, did I unlock this one? I think somewhere around here there is a shortcut. But I think I might have to unlock it from the other side. We'll find out. I've managed to unlock a few secrets during this playthrough that I hadn't unlocked before. So I'm just sort of keeping an eye out for anything I might have accidentally missed. I hate these things. There's actually anything in this way, so I'm just going to go and check. Um, no, I need some form of key. I can't get up there either yet. It's fine, so we're going to go down here instead.
guy. He's dead. Can't go through there yet. Let's go up here first. It's not the attacks that annoy me, it's the teleporting. You just can never get... Well, obviously there I did. But it's really hard to get close enough to them to do anything. Get some healing done. Record Abba. The mind still limits us so. How to break past its its constraints. To attain a pure focus, is it even possible? magic instead of dash button. There we go. Right, now I've got to be careful. Stop it going down. Down feels like the safer option. Because I genuinely can't remember this bit. Nope, dead. It's fine. It's all good. Let's try again. I'm just losing too many lives in really stupid places. I'm sure anyone that's actually good at this game is getting really frustrated me. Frustrated with me. Stop teleporting. Oh, come on. Okay. Again, not how I wanted to use that, but didn't have much of a choice. this take me. Oh, nice. Um, 
just think there's definitely a shortcut back towards that um, bench. So I'm just going to have another look to see if I can find it. There. See? Lovely. Not going to use it now, just because it's going to that will respawn everything. But it's just nice to know it's there. Oops. Okay, up we go. Um, it was through here, wasn't it? Through here, up here. The only thing, anything there. Worlds will come better in a minute. The other thing that um, people that are into the tech side of this stuff might like to know is that I'm playing this um, straight through OBS. So instead of having it open in a window and playing it in the window, I've got it open in a window and then I'm screen grabbing that straight from OBS. Um, so there's like a 0.2 second lag, but I'm not good enough for that to matter. That's really confusing. Oh, I remember where I am now. There's a boss coming up that I don't, really don't like. up. Get moving. Uh, nothing through there. I'm going to say there's going to be another one in there. Definitely don't remember this from the last time I played it. Lots of healing plays. There we go. Oh, more of them. There we go. Spell Twister. Definitely didn't get that last time. What's it do? Reflecting the desires of the soul sanctum for mastery of a soul, it improves the... Oh. It improves the bearer's ability to cast spells, reduce the soul cost of casting spells. That sounds useful. I'll have to equip that when I get a chance.
this is it. This is, in my opinion, the second most annoying fight in the entire game. And for the people that know the game, in my opinion, the most annoying fight in the entire game is the Traitor Lord. But we'll get on to that later. Here he comes. Not a good start. Really not a good start. No, I'm dead. I'm not winning this. Even more. No. Oh. This is going to be a really bad stream. I just know it. Shut up! I forgot to unplug it again. Um. Oh, I don't need. One sec, let's do this properly. I don't need those. Let's get. That might be useful. Yeah, let's go with those two. There are so many charms I should have that I just don't. And I don't know how I've managed to miss them. Maybe that's what I should be doing instead of this fight. No. I've committed to the fight. Let's do the fight. If by the end of this stream I haven't completed this fight, then I will come when I do my next episode, I will spend the episode looking for charms and then um, come back when I've got some charms and some power-ups and whatnot. Yeah, that's a fun thing that you I learnt the hard way the first time I did this. You can't run away from those shamans or sorcerers or whatever you want to call them. Because they just teleport after you wherever you go. If you leave the room you're fine, but I've never been able to leave the room fast enough. Those are regrets or whatever is the woman calls it. And here's the boss. Let's do this. No. 
got an itchy eye. Don't scratch it, don't scratch it, just keep fighting. No, I oh, can never dodge that. Right. I think I just panicked on that. And then I get hit and it doesn't work out. Ooh, there we did, did it. Stop teleporting! Should have taken that opportunity to heal. Oh. No. Okay, we've got nine minutes left of the stream. We can do this. I can do this. No offence, but I know you. If you're hearing me say this, you're watching, but you're not really helping much. So I'm going to stick to what I've got. This. Okay, here we go. Take that. Kill him. Kill him. Or her, or it. I think it's probably an it. I think when you become a sludge, you lose all concept of gender, so. I might be wrong. They might be really gender aware sludge. But okay, let's get some healing done. What I will say about these bosses is that I've been playing um, Bloodborne the last couple of weeks. As you can probably assume, I'm not very good at it. But what I have learned... No, not what I've learned. What I've been improving on is my ability to just come back over and over again and just keep going at it, improve every time. Um, I just think it's just that sort of perseverance that's getting me a bit further through this game a bit quicker than I normally would. Oh. No, I mistimed it. Ooh. 
no. Come on. I need to stop doing that. I keep losing my opportunities to heal because I'm getting over whatever it is. Oh. Let's need to land a hit so I can get some. So, no. I really don't like this boss. Okay. Fix the GA, that's it. Might be able to afford something after killing everything 600 times to get to that boss. All I'm saying is, teleportation and flight, yeah, isn't fair. Pick one or the other. Some of us don't get either. We just got to walk everywhere. going to leg it into the other room. I'm not even going to stop. I normally go for that so underneath me. not going to bother. just going to leg it. There we go. Fill these up. Right, this is probably going to... Yeah, this is going to be my last attempt um, because we've only got two minutes until the end of the stream, so enjoy. Let's see how far we can get. again. There you go, it's crashed it, we're all good. <laughs> oh, never jump over that.
See, the only thing is I knew that was coming. I even got an achievement to say he's dead, so now let's claim this. Desolate dive. Tap circle while holding down to strike the earth with a burst of power. Spells will deplete cell, replenish shell by striking opponents. Okay, so that this was where I was going to end the stream, but I've just had the thought that there's not a bench here. So I'm going to have to go on a bit of a wander to find the nearest bench. Then after that, um, I'll end it there. So you've got a little bit longer than half an hour. Lucky you. Or unlucky you if you don't like my content. But if you don't like my content, then you can just turn off. So doesn't really affect you at all, does it? Okay. A little bit more so. Right, let's do this. That's so fun. the way we came through. That time we went a bit too far. I'm just going to back it up and grab some stuff. Lunar seal, very nice. Let's do some healing and then whack this to get some soul. Oh, too far again. Geo now. Right, let's go and get that. So, uh, I was going to say scrub, it's not scrub, scrub. Scrub is something different. Right, there we go. And down we go. Hello, mister. Or missus. Oh, missed it. 
There we go. Then we're back to the bench. If we have a quick look at our map. Look at all this stuff we filled in. Right, so. Thank you very much for joining me for the sixth episode. I want to say it's sixth. I hope it's sixth. Um, what's that? Yeah, six, yeah, sixth episode. Welcome. Thank you for joining me for the sixth episode of my playthrough of Hollow Knight. Um, join me next week for episode seven. And as I said, for episode seven we will be doing a bit of a run round trying to find all of the... Not all of them, but some of the charms that I've um, missed. Oh, fell off the bench. Um, just so that when I go and do some of the other fights that I don't like very much, uh, I've got a bit more of a chance. So we'll be doing that next week. Uh, on Wednesday, um, I will be playing the name of the guy game that's gone from my head one moment and I will double check it um, Aragami Aragami 2 uh, so they had the first episode of that on Wednesday um, and my new episode is coming out this Wednesday so please do check that out if that's something that interests you and on Saturday we have the next episode of Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy. Now I think we're getting quite close to the end of that. So I've got a few more ideas in my brain about what our next game after that is going to be. Um, I think I have decided, but I'm going to keep that a secret for now. Um, so do join me for those if they sound like they're going to interest you. If not, don't worry, it's completely fine. Free country, do what you want. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please do give me a like down below. It really does help and um, subscribe if you'd like to see more of my content um, it's free which is great and it means the world to me whenever people do um, other than that thank you very much for watching and I shall see you all very very soon and I think instead of switching over to the uh, to the thumbnail I'm just gonna leave you with the image of the night falling asleep on the bench with gentle music in the background see you all very soon bye